Hi guys, welcome back to my channel today and for today's video I'm going to be doing an everyday makeup routine. This is basically what I just wear on a general basis. It's updated from my last last <laughs> it's updated from last year's video, so I hope you guys like this video. That was really weird. Okay, let's get into it. So first off I'm gonna start by priming my face. Um, I'm gonna use this Stay Flawless. 15, is it focusing? Focusing, it is now. Stay Flawless 15 hour primer, and I'm just gonna do it all over my face like so. And then you're just gonna blend it out with your fingers. Just make sure all that product is evenly distributed. I hope my mirror isn't like covering the camera lens. I'm trying so hard, okay? <laughs> so, and make sure you do it underneath the eye lids as well. And also I apply a little bit on my eyelid just so to work as like a eye primer as well because there's no point using two different primers for the exact same thing okay so some days i actually skip out on wearing um foundation i actually don't wear a foundation i wear this um la pro la girl pro concealer which is this product it's the la girl pro concealer in the shade beautiful bronze um I've got one that's kind of like running out here, so I'm just gonna use this one. And I just apply it to my face on any imperfections or like dark spots only, like so. I don't really apply a lot of this product on, to be honest, because I don't feel like I need it. And also because it's summer, I can't really be asked to melt in this heat because it's ridiculous. It's like 30 degrees, and I know that's like not ridiculous for everyone else but it is ridiculous for here. So, <laughs> I'm in the north of England, by the way, so to me, it just feels absolutely ridiculous. The other day, I was literally going to melt. So, <laughs> and I'm gonna blend it out with my ring finger. And you just wanna make sure it's all even the product. See, that is way too much for my forehead. So I'm gonna like just play it out and just act like I didn't do that. <laughs> I'm gonna do the other side. I'm not really wearing a lot today because um, I can't be bothered and it really is, it's so hot like it will just melt off. So I just want a little bit on my face to cover it. And I've also like been trying really, really hard lately to be healthy and I feel like that does so much for my skin already, especially drinking water. Guys drink so much water because it helps People think it's a myth. It is not a myth. It really does help. I honestly don't know why people are still using beauty blenders. Like literally just use your fingers. It saves so much time, but to be fair, I get it, a beauty blender, it doesn't even cost that much and it's like, it does the same thing, but it honestly just saves time. So next step I'm gonna do is I'm going to set my like concealer. I keep calling it foundation, it's not foundation. And I'm just using this um, product here. I don't know if it's gonna focus. Is it gonna focus? Okay, well, it's just basically this. It's in the shade transparent. Um, the top kind of faded off anyways, so I'll just tell you what it is. I think it was like the Rimmel London Stay Matte. It's like one of those Stay Matte powders. And I'm just gonna pat it on my face, like so. And I'm just gonna lightly blend it out. I don't know why I'm speaking like this. I sound like someone from Harry Potter. And I'm just going to blend, 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 blend. So just do it evenly. Make sure you blend here as well. You don't want to look like weird and cakey. Okay, so the next step I'm gonna do is go in with some eyeshadow. And I'm using this Avon palette here. I'm gonna show you what shades I'm gonna use. So I'm gonna use these shades. This one is gonna go as my main one and this one's gonna go as my crease color. I literally just use these two shades because I'm lazy. I use this shade from this W7 Lightly Toasted Cosmetics palette and I use this one here as my inner tear duct color. So I'm gonna use this like, kind of like this toasted like color. I don't even know what to describe it as. It literally looks like a 
like a bronze toasted color. So, and then I'm gonna go in with the crease color. And you just wanna like blend it, blend it, blend it. You want it in like a kind of triangle. Next, I'm gonna go in with this bright, it's like a light in a teardrop color. I don't even know how to describe it. The key is to blend with this look. I went to Macedonia and my friend who was there, Maria, she's a makeup artist and she did my makeup and she blended so much and I was like, okay, she's blending a lot, but she did such an amazing job and I was like, I have literally been skimping out on the blending of my shadows and it makes such a difference. She did an amazing job on my makeup, I was so pleasantly surprised. Next, I'm going to go in with my eyebrows, so I'm going to use this spoolie here to brush them out. Then I'm going to go in with this Miss Sporty, um, it's not even an eyebrow pencil, it's an eyeliner, but it works so well. Then I'm just going to go in like this, you really want to just fill out the gaps. Some days if I'm feeling fancy, I will go in with like a, um, the, the brow bone. I put like a bit of highlighter there, but I, I don't think I can be bothered today to be honest. It's not that fancy, it's everyday. But if you have really squeaky eyebrows, you just want to go pop, go ahead, do you do that? Because it, it makes your eyebrows look like super on fleek. It takes it to like extreme levels of fleekish. And that's my eyebrows. Um, I don't even highlight my eyebrows. I'm sorry, I'm like really basic with my eyebrows because I don't really like that highlighted eyebrow trend. I think some people take it a bit too far. Next, I'm gonna go in with some eyeliner. I'm using this Maybelline Master Graphic. I'm sorry if you can't see it. Can you see it? Can you kind of see it? No, you can't. Okay, it's called Maybelline Master Graphic. It's this really cool pen. It's super easy to use. I mentioned it before in another video. Right, so I'm gonna use some black eyeliner. I'm using this sleek midnight, um, Eyeliner, it's just a eyeliner, just on her halfway through, and then I'm gonna quickly finish up my eyes with some mascara. So I'm using this L'Oreal Paris False Lash Superstar. It's got two sides. First, you put the white coat on like so, and then you use the other side and put the whoops. <laughs> use the black side and uh, trust me guys this mascara is the bomb it is so good one of the best high street ones i've used so bam here are my eyes i'm so up oh, it looks so pretty in this light okay so these are the eyes i'm just gonna quickly do my lips and i'm just using this collection 2000 uh, lipstick in the shade 11 um, um, <laughs> <laughs> Amethyst Shine and it's just like so and uh, that's just it. Oh yeah. Burn my lips, there we go. And that's me done. That only takes about 20 minutes in total. I'm probably like a little bit. You didn't sit for 20 minutes, I can assure you, because I will not edit it for to be that long. So here is my everyday makeup look. It's really simple, really easy and I hope you guys liked it. Um, yeah, so it's just really easy and simple and straightforward. Sometimes when I'm feeling extra fancy fancy, I put a little bit of highlighter, a little bit of um, contouring, but I, I, this is every day. I'm not gonna lie to you guys that I wake up every day wearing contour and highlight to school or, or uni or, or out, because I don't. <laughs> and I think this is just bearable for the heat as well. So I hope you guys like this video. You can click no wait what <laughs> you can like comment and i hope you guys subscribe to my channel as well bye